guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're doing a what I eat in a day. So today is Monday and so I've got a, a bit of a busy day. I've got to wrap some presents. Um, I've just got a couple of small errands to run and I've got a pretty full work day. So I'm going to be home most of the day, but I will have to get out eventually. And y'all today it is cold out there. It is so cold. Um, I would say the number one thing on my agenda today is wrapping presents. Although, I do need to refill, replenish back there my feelings because we got our box in a couple days ago, or actually more days ago than that. <laughs> this was almost empty and I started to fill it and then we've just been pulling out of the box instead of me getting it organized like I'm supposed to, so I do need to do that. Ivy, she does this every time I start to video. It doesn't matter what the video is here lately. She just needs her attention. Okay, so what am I having this morning? I'm having a coffee shake with, having coffee with my dark chocolate shake. So I love to use hazelnut flavored coffee and mix it with dark chocolate. It's just a great, yummy flavor combination. So I'm gonna brew my coffee right into my shaker bottle. Here we go. Okay, so I have everything mixed in here, my shake, and I forgot to show you me uh, pouring it in. It's okay. My shake, pour it in with my coffee, and now I'm going to shake it up. And always, like I tell you, when it's hot like this, do it slow to begin with and then burp it. Yeah, steam just came flying out. If you don't let that steam out, which I have done, it will, like, spew. Feeling my Nana cup today. All right, here we go. Y'all, this is so simple, so delicious. It makes... Um, to me, it's like extremely rich dark chocolate. Can you see it? It smells so good, it's hot, hold on. Mm, it's so good, so warm. It's a perfect um, breakfast. Now, if I was like on the go, if I was like heading out, I would just leave it in this, pop straw in there and go. I'm home, so I'm gonna take this cup out on the porch with the pups, cause she's about to have a fit. And I'll see you back here for fueling number two, which may be on the go because I do have to run to the store. Hey guys, I'm trying to hold this. Um, I'm in the midst of getting all my stuff ready to wrap. So I need something quick. So my second fueling today is going to be a bar. This is the Double Crunch, I think, Double Crunch Peanut Butter Bar. Here, I'll open it and show you. Okay, here it is, y'all. Peanut butter, and it's so good it tastes like peanut butter. This is one of the things, I always say it, that I love the most about Optavia. It fits in a busy, busy life. I mean, I, I don't got time to stop and cook something. <laughs> if y'all could see what was around me right now, oh my, okay. I'm gonna go eat my bar. I will catch y'all back here for my third fueling. Okay guys, boy, this day is really getting away from me. Um, I'm running late for my third fueling. Um, so that happens sometimes, you know, life happens. But I'm very busy and, and it's still so chilly outside. I'd, coffee just sounds good to me today. So I'm making another shake, but this time I'm gonna use my caramel drizzle coffee. Um, it's really, I love this caramel drizzle coffee. I'm gonna mix it with my vanilla shake and I'm gonna add some eggnog syrup. I've only used this once and I did it with the vanilla and my chai tea and it was pretty good. But I thought it'd be really good with caramel. So I'm gonna mix that together for my third fueling and I know this has been kind of a boring what I eat in a day, but sometimes life is just boring. <laughs> but anyway, you know, it's, it's fine because it, you know, this program just fits into everything. It fits into a really busy day at home, which this has been, and it also fits in a busy day when you're out and about. So let me get my shake going. Uh, I've got to brew my coffee and then I'm gonna mix it all up. I'll show you what I'm gonna do. This will have to count as a condiment. Uh, the rest of it is just a fueling. Now hold on. Okay, my coffee is brewed. I'm gonna add, this is two tablespoons of that eggnog flavored sugar-free syrup. The brand is Da Vinci. There's also another brand called Tarani. I haven't, I haven't been able to find it, but the Da Vinci is pretty good. I'm gonna pour in my shake, creamy vanilla shake. Get my lid screwed on nice and tight. Yeah, and as I always say, Gotta hear the pop and shake slow to begin. You'll probably get tired of me saying that, but I don't want hot coffee spewing on you. I think we're all shook up. My dogs love when I have shakes because 
they just automatically think that means they're going outside. Because I usually make my, especially if it's coffee. It's weird how dogs get so conditioned. All right, here we go. It smells so good, y'all. All right, I have never done it this way. So this is a first. Let's see how, how it tastes. Pretty good that's good you know I'm gonna be I'm gonna be honest I'm gonna give you an honest review it's good I like it <laughs> but I'm gonna tell you that caramel coffee with the caramel macchiato shake way better I think I like the chai with the vanilla the chai tea with this vanilla works better this is good I'm gonna drink it but I think the other one actually does work better but hmm, this is good I'm gonna say hi to the puppies say hi girls <laughs> Hey there guys. Okay, I am getting ready for my fourth feeling of the day and this whole day has been behind. I am running so late. It's just been a Monday. It has just been a Monday, let's just be real. Monday is my heaviest client support day and on top of that, I have been trying to get my presents organized to wrap and wham, wham, wham. Life is hard. <laughs> I'm just explaining why I'm running late. I'm having the chewy chocolate chip cookie. Now y'all, this little chocolate chip cookie, people do a lot of things with this thing. Uh, they make them into actual cookies, put them in the oven. I've done it that way, it's really good. People waffle them. My personal health coach, she does that I think every day. She waffles it and she puts a little ready whip on top and it's like her favorite, it's, it's like her pudding. You know how I do my pudding? That's like her pudding. Me, I keep it a super simple. I pour it in the little ramekin that it came. Now, I've done it different ways. But, you know, when you're having a day like this, where you just, you know, you're busy, you just need fuel for your body, you just got to keep going. Let's just keep it simple. That's what I love about Optivia. I'm going to label this, keeping it simple. Two tablespoons with my tiny measuring cup. That's a mainstay measuring cup. Got it at Walmart for like a buck. Love them. I have like four of them because I use them all the time. Um, it's going to be real thick. Let me show you. Here, let me put this down on the counter. Now, see that? It's, it's real thick. It only takes two tablespoons where most of our feelings take three. Into the microwave. I think it's for a minute, 10 seconds. So it was actually a minute, it's actually a minute, 15 seconds. I wanted to show you all this too. Here's another little trick. I love little tiny spatulas for mixing things up. I like my tiny little measuring cup because it's tablespoon measurements. And then I love these tiny spoons. They're called, um, what are these called? Like Demi Toss, is that right? Demi Toss spoons, something like that. Some fancy name like that. <laughs> They're tiny spoons. I like them for my feelings. Now, not all my feelings, but like my pudding, I use a big spoon, a regular spoon, because no. <laughs> I gotta have a big bite of my pudding. But for these and for the brownie, things like that, I even sometimes for the mashed potatoes, I like these tiny spoons. Anyway, I just thought I'd talk to you about tiny spoons while I'm waiting on my, my cookie to get done. And I don't um, wait. Once the cookie comes out, I let it cool off just a little bit. But in my opinion, a chocolate chip cookie has to be warm and gooey or it's not a chocolate chip cookie. So it's ready. It's steaming, y'all. Oh, it smells so good. See, that's what it looks like in the little ramekin. I know that's not like terribly attractive, but y'all trust me. It's so good. Here, let me just get a. Mm -hmm. Can y'all can y'all see it? It's so good. I quit ordering these for a while. I don't know. You just do that. You know, you go through spurts where you order something over and over. The only thing that I haven't stopped ordering that I order over and over is the chocolate pudding and the dark chocolate shake. But other things I'll go in spurts, you know, and so I kind of quit ordering these for a while. And so Scott didn't even know they existed. <laughs> and one day I made one and he was like, what is that? So like, it's a chewy chocolate chip cookie. He felt so left out and deprived. So I ordered more so he could have some. I don't think he's tried it yet. I need to get him to try one. <gasps> Maybe I'll do that tonight. We could shake it up. If I could, I don't know. He's he's with his brownie like I am with my pudding. But maybe. All right, I think it's cooled off enough, y'all. Mm, here we go. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. 
chewy chocolate chip cookie. That's what it's supposed to be. All right, y'all. I'm gonna go eat my chocolate chip cookie. And then uh, y'all meet us back here, me and Scott. I think we're gonna do pizza tonight, little mini pizzas. I think that's what we're gonna do. I need something simple. Yeah, definitely need something simple. Abby, what are you doing back there? There she is. Abby, you come up here and say hi. Come here. <laughs> say hello to the people. <laughs> All right, guys. All right, I'm gonna go eat my chocolate chip cookie and I'll see y'all back here for me and Scott and our leaning green. Pizza night. Yes. We love pizza night. Um, okay, let, let me show you our pizzas. We're doing mini pizzas. So these are the outer aisle crusts. Three of these is a half a lean and one green. So- Excellent. You, yeah, so I've got, um, I've got jalapenos and bell peppers on mine and the Reyes marinara. That makes up my two other greens. Scott has the Reyes marinara that makes up one more green, and then he's got broccoli. You can't see it, but he's got broccoli to make up his other because he doesn't like any veggies on his pizza. We both have a little bit of light ranch for our healthy fat, and we're about to dig in, peeps. That's right. Hungry time. Oh, yeah. So good. I love these little outer aisle crusts. We did that. Um, you know, I had my um, little bestie get together yesterday. Y'all saw the video this morning, um, or y'all saw it. You're gonna see this tomorrow, so it was yesterday when we saw it. <laughs> That's what we did. It was a, it was a great way to safely eat as a group, right. you know, so you didn't have one person, you know, handling everything. So I brought the pizza crusts, and everybody brought their own toppings, and we prepared our own individual pizzas. Oh, look at you. And it it was good. It was healthy, and it right. was safe. All right, let's dig in. Y'all, mm -mm -mm -mm. so good. So the way you do your protein. So this is. Um, half of a lean so then the rest of my lean is made up between the cheese and the meat and depending on what meat you choose mm. um depending on what type of cheese you choose that's how you're going to decide the portion so get with your coach if you're not sure how to do that but you should be able to do it you know based on the portions in your optavia guide so here we go oh i've already eaten <laughs> oh, yeah. that's too much talking it's time to eat <laughs> What are you saying? I talk too much. Oh, no. Never. That's what you say. Mm -mm. I don't blame him. I do. I say it all the time that I talk too much. <laughs> all right, guys. We're going to go eat our pizza. We'll see you back for our fifth and final fueling. Mm. Hang on. I told them, you know, because you, you hadn't tried the chocolate chip cookie. Mm -hmm. um, the other night when I had it, you were all like, what is that? So I thought maybe if you wanted to, you could. You I know, can branch out. And try the chocolate chip cookie tonight. Give your honest review. Maybe. Uh, that, you got the brownie. That just, that just don't we'll keep them in suspense. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, we'll see you back in a minute. I couldn't get him to branch out, y'all. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is the chocolate chip brownie. Oh, just the brownie. Yeah, I couldn't get him to branch. And I don't blame I'll him. branch another time. So, dang, I'll have to have brownie tonight. Oh, I know. He's so sad about <laughs> it. <laughs> I made this up way ahead of time, so it's wow. really thick. It's really thick. Don't do it. I could see it in his eyes. He was fixing to do it, man. You're mm -mm. just making it sound so good. Well, it is good. <laughs> but you got to get your own, Bubba. <laughs> I was to share. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> That's the golden rule. Don't pull that on me. <laughs> <laughs> Not with my pudding. Yeah. <laughs> you know, anyway, you guys. Is it going to go off? No, that's it. <laughs> I oh, see the squirrel. I'm tired. It's been a long day, man. <laughs> it's, you know, the, I, he knows squirrels <laughs> jumping around in his head all the time. All right, guys, I'm going to go eat my pudding. There you go. I don't know what he's doing, but I'm going to go <laughs> eat my pudding. I'm going to my brownie. All right, you guys, um, as always, you guys just have a blessed day. Be safe. Y'all stay well. And we're, we're out. out. Have a good day, y'all.